What's up guys, my name is Kays. Today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video. What I'm going to be talking about with you guys is Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. We got some brand new news today. By the time you're watching this, it should be. And everything, we got specialists, aka rig setups and all of that. I'm going to talk about everything that we've seen at the multiplayer reveal. And yeah, let's get straight into it. The brand new stuff we saw come into Infinite Warfare after reveal are the combat rigs. I'm going to talk to you guys about that. Basically, what the combat rigs are, it's like a specialist. It's a different way of playing the game. There's about six, I think, of them. I'm not exactly sure. And you can use a payload where you get like a certain ability for that combat rig. There's like a Merc, there's Warfighter, and there's Synaptic, FTL, stuff like that. And they're all different rigs. So like, it's like a specialist from Black Ops 3. And I think it's a really cool idea because I did like specialists quite a lot. So I think it's not a bad idea to come in to Infinite Warfare. Now the movement system for Infinite Warfare isn't bad. It's just the Black Ops 3 movement. We got the wall run, we got the boost, and everything like that. We don't have the double, well, you know, the small double jump. We don't have the AWs type. We have Infinite Warfare, Black Ops 3 kind of mixed together. It's like the same type of movement. So basically, it's like Black Ops 3 movement at, like, completely. And you got the Infinite Warfare style. Of course, we have the sliding, uh, the dolphin dives in the past. We got the sliding now, which is really cool. And even in the specialist, you have where on the bottom right corner, you can pull out the specialist exactly like that in Infinite Warfare, which is awesome. And there's weapon crafting and all that, which is crazy. There's also a nuclear kill streak in the game, a tactical nuke, which is a 25 kill streak, which is crazy. Um, it doesn't end the game, I'm, I don't think so. It's just a nuke, basically like a KEM in Ghost. Um, it doesn't end the game at all, which is okay. I think it's a really cool idea how they have all this. For weapon crafting, there's each weapon has a common, rare, legendary, and epic variants. You can unlock them by playing the game, and you can get different weapons been variants for it as well with weapon you know crafting to move over to infinite warfare to move over to modern warfare remastered a little bit basically we're going to be getting all 16 multiplayer maps from the original game and six of them will be coming out at december time and you'll have 10 at the start and they're going to be free the other six so you don't have to pay for them it's an incredible like thing uh you have to get the legacy edition of course to get the modern warfare remastered which i'm totally okay with the maps look pretty cool infinite warfare to move back to that they look insanely cool they don't look like they're on space i'm glad it's not too futuristic right now in my opinion uh let me know what you guys think down below i hope you guys enjoyed if you guys did smash the like button um sorry if i didn't cover everything i'm just trying to get this video out and cover what i actually know because not everything has been revealed yet but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed leave a like subscribe if you guys are new they also have some uplink in there as well which is cool but yeah see you guys in the next one you've been the case crew i've been case peace out